Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to talk about utility panel here under the home tab. So I'm going to cover cover the mirror here. If you click this small triangle, you can see different tools. We have the quick mirror. We also have mirror for some specific tools like distance, radius, angle, area, and volume. So let's try to the quick. If we click quick, it's going to show up vertical line and the horizontal line. If we move the cursor, so the line is going to move. We can move it to the vertical direction. We can move it to the horizontal direction. So when the line touch on some drawing, touch on the object, touch on the line, the line segment is going to show up the number. We can see the length of the line segment. We can also see the angle. Look at here, we see the 45 degree. Here we see the radius. Here we also see the radius. If we put inside this rectangular, I'm going to see the width and the length. We also see the right angle, the sign of the right angle. This is ellipse, it didn't show anything. This is effective only for the line, line segment. Look at here, this is a pentagon. I put the inside the pentagon, it's going to show the angle. It also show the length, the side length. So this is a quick measure. We can use it to quickly measure, quickly measure it, measure the angle and measure the line segment. So if we click this small triangle, we are going to see distance. We can also click, click, click distance. First, let's see. Look at the command window. We need to specify the first point. Let's say I want to know the length of this line. So I click the first point and I click the, the end point. Now look at here. I'm going to see delta x. This is the length. We also see the distance. Distance here. So let's click the distance again. So I want to mirror from the here to here. This is the diagonal length. Click it. Now I'm going to see the distance is here. We also see we also see the delta x and the delta y. So this is the, the length of the of this diagonal line and the width of the the width of the diagonal line. Actually it's like the projection of the x direction and the y direction. So you can measure the distance with the distance too. Let's do the radius now. Click it, look at the command window. We need to select arc and circle. This is the circle. We click it. Now look at here. It shows the radius and show diameter. Let's click again. This is the arc. Click the arc. Now it shows the radius and also shows the diameter. Now let's go to the angle two. Let's see, we need to select arc, circle, line, or specific, specify the vertex. Let's see here. I select the first line. I select the second line. Now it's going to show the angle is 135. So let's do the angle again. I want to click this line and this line and see it. Click here and click here. Now it shows the angle. This is 90 degree. 
Let's try this one. Click angle. Click this line. Click this line. And let's try to select it again. And click this line. And click this line. Now it shows angle 108. So go to the utility, select the area. Now I have the rectangular, but I want to know the area. So look at here. Come on, window. We can select the object. So now I need to select the object. I click the object. Now it shows the area. It also shows the Parameter. So let's click mirror, click mirror, and uh, this time I want to also select object. Look at the common window. Click here, select the lips, click the object. Now I'm going to see the error, error here. So same thing if you want to mirror the volume, where the error for this one. You can you can mirror it. So let's do the mirror for the for the volume. For the volume, we don't have we don't quite have it because this is the two D. But we can also draw draw object mirror. Let's try it. Click here object. I want to select the ellipse. Look at here, we need to specify the height because here we only see, select one, sur one service. We need the height to get the volume. So we can't really use it for the 2D. So actually, if we select the quick, quick measure as the command window, we can also have the option distance, radius, angle, area, volume, and quick mode. So you can decide how to use it. Thank you very much for your watching.